The 58th annual Grammys gave everyone a piece of the awards pie, including Taylor Swift, who won Album of the Year for her collection, 1989, and Mark Ronson with Bruno Mars for Uptown Funk for Record of the Year. During her acceptance speech, Swift, who became the first woman to win two Album of the Year awards, gave some advice to women about making it in the industry, but it was a thinly veiled message to rapper Kanye West, who claims on his just released album that his diss of Taylor Swift years ago at the MTV Awards made her famous. I want to say to all the young women out there, there are going to be people along the way who will try to undercut your success or take credit for your accomplishments or your fame. But if you just focus on the work and you don't let those people sidetrack you, someday when you get where you're going, you'll look around and you will know that it was you and the people who love you who put you there. Then there was Bruno Mars jumping the gun and prodding Beyonce to hurry up and announce the winner of Record of the Year. Grammy goes to... Uptown Funk. Producers Jeff Baxter, Tom Coyne, Philip Lawrence, Bruno Mars, and Mark Ronson. Lastly, there were the tributes for the evening, which included David Bowie by Lady Gaga, the one to Lemmy of Motorhead by the all-star group Hollywood Vampires, which included Joe Perry of Aerosmith and Johnny Depp on guitars. We'll have more on that tribute a little later on. My new friends, Pentatonic and me, are going to do a song a tribute for a beautiful friend who brought our world earth, wind, and fire. And so much healing music. Maurice White, may you rest in eternal bliss and peace. Take it easy, take it easy. Other multiple Grammy winners this year included Kendrick Lamar, Ed Sheeran, and Alabama Shakes. Never thought I'd be here doing this. 